What's going on, Show Nation? Episode 5 of Road to the World Series begins now. Thank you so much for the support. Be sure to hit that subscribe button. My only goal is to get to 100,000 subscribers so I can get that silver play button. Please be a part of the grind. I'm out here trying to post the gameplay every single day. 3 p.m. Eastern, so make sure to subscribe so you don't miss it. Make sure to hit that thumbs up button. It really, really, really helps me out as well. Make sure to check out the merch as well. And if you do end up getting the merch, make sure you hit me up on Twitter so I can personally thank you. Thank you to everybody that's picked up the merch. Really, really helps me out as well. Let's go ahead and jump into the gameplay. Our rating is at 801. All right, so we found our opponent in this one, Puerto Rico, um, Yell PR, Yelly PR. Uh, Mike Trout, Corey Seager, Randy Rosarina, Freddie Freeman, Chipper Jones, Ronald Acuna, Cody Bellinger, and Yasmani Grandal. He's got his creative player pitcher on the hill, so this should be interesting. He's at 70 and 26, which is a really, really solid record. Um, we got Bauer on the hill who doesn't have full energy, so hopefully he can do pretty well. But none of our pitchers have, none of our starters have full energy right now, so we got to make do with what we got to make do with. I'd say he has about 85% of his energy. 96 mile an hour sinker retires Mike Trout. Seager is going to hit that one, but it's going to be right at Bellinger. Base hit up the middle for Randy Arroz Arena. Mantle cuts it off and throws it into second to keep him at a single. We got a runner on the play. Arroz Arena takes off on the slider. He's going to make it into second with the stolen base. And we're going to get Freddie Freeman swinging. So he's got the crazy motion for his cap in this one. And Willie Mays does not care. He's late on it, but he hits it perfectly to the gap. He's on his horse. No one's picked the ball up. I think we're to stay at second. We don't want to make our first out of third base. We'll just, we'll take that double. And Cody to the right side with the base hit. I'm not going to try it either. I'm just going to chill. Maybe we would have been able to run to second, but if he cuts that off, we would have been out. Two on for Trout. That's going to be a low pitch that we absolutely crushed Freeman there to make the catch. It's going to be a base hit up the middle for Mantle, so we're going to get the first run across. Oh, so out in front of that changeup. Salvador Perez, another huge home run early in the ball game. Just absolutely smoked that ball too. Big three run shot. And he ends up just quitting the game. So we're going to play another one. This is literally my fifth friendly quit <laughs> trying to record this video. We played that one game and he quit. I I've been taking all the friendly quits though, because honestly, when I don't, they just don't like it just I don't know. I can tell the other person's like pissed off. So it's like, I got to wait for that situation where it's not a friendly quit, but just know this is actually my, that's the fifth one I've had. So hopefully we can find somebody. I do like having the friendly quit in the game because of the, your opponents like lagging, you know, that's like a good situation to take that friendly quit. But man, the, the friendly quits, I feel like now are just so out of control in a way. Like I, if they did away with it, I wouldn't be too upset about it. Hopefully he wants to play. I hope hopefully he doesn't send another friendly quit. I'd much rather play at a better stadium than this, but I got to kind of make do with what's going on. And he sends another friendly quit. So we got to accept. Okay, so we found our opponent in this one, the Midwest Dogs, the firm Earn Dog 58. He's got Kershaw, Hornsby, Cody Bellinger, Mickey Mantle, Juan Soto. He's got the Chipper Jones, Mike Trout. He's got his cap at catcher, I believe. Let's see what his record is. He is 517 and 116. So his record is absolutely insane. Uh, this is going to be a really difficult win. He's got multiple, multiple top 50 finishes. First uh, ball put in play here, and it's going to be caught out in center by Mickey Mantle. Cody Bellinger. On a pitch right down the middle, shoots it over the center field wall for a home run. Great pitch on three and two. We should have taken that pitch for a walk. Went after it anyways. Nice play by his cap. He's got his cap at shortstop. Makes the play there. And he's going to dot a sinker. 
one to zero as we go to the bottom of the first. Leave a pitch in the middle. Hornsby's going to ground that one out to Cody Bellinger. And Cody Bellinger for him takes the slider and absolutely crushes it. That was a deep, deep home run. And Mickey Mantle lifts that one off to deep left field, up over Trout Ted into my bullpen for a home run. Juan Soto pops that one up. Burns is under it, and he will make the catch. Chipper Jones digs a change up out for a home run. And we're going to get Mike Trout to pop up to Perez. We're really, really going to have to hit in this game. It's already three to one after the first. And there's a rip for Seager rolling close to the wall. We're going to try to push this into a double and we're going to get there. Perez shoots that one through the right side, laid on it, but found a hole. He's going to put a curveball in there. We're going to get a base hit three to two game. And not the best swing on that one. We're going to be late for the first out, not running only 35 speed for Perez. Corbin Burns flies it up to right field. I'm all right with that. Just stay out of the double play. All right, this is a situation where we got to clutch. The, we need these runs. We got to keep this inning going. Huge, huge situation early. And that that slide art just had enough break on it to make me miss. So we did not come through there. On the ground up the middle, Seager can't quite get there. Base hit for his cap. On the ground, and it has eyes. It's going to find it its way into left field for a base hit. He worked it full with Kershaw, but we do dot it up to get a strikeout. Pretty good cutter that he's going to drive into the right field gap, but we got speed with Mays out there to make the catch. He's going to be able to tag up, but we'll take that out. That's a big out there. Now we just need one more to clutch up and get out of it. And we left it in the middle. It was hit really hard by Bellinger with that gold defense. Gets in front of it, so we couldn't even both of us couldn't clutch up when we needed to. Three to two. We need some better swings in this one. We've been a little bit late. He's gonna throw a curveball on the outside. We really worked that count. Got eight pitches, hit it to the warning track. That's a low pitch. It's gonna be a fastball. We are all over that. Home run from Mike Trout to tie it up. Oh, we should have had a much better swing on that one. Got under with Mantle. Easy out. Ooh, that sinker. We just got under it. He's throwing me a lot of, like, inside sliders. And Mickey Mantle goes deep. This is going to be a fun game because he's really good. Another home run. Right in the middle on that sinker. He crushes it the opposite way. And we're going to get Chipper Jones to strike out. Trout's going to roll over on that cutter. Right to Jimmy. Easy out. Caps in a laser one to center field for a base hit. Really need to win this at bat because I really think he's going to take out Kershaw, honestly. So we can't really intentionally walk. We just got to go after Jimmy Fox. And he just turns and burns on an inside sinker. That is a great swing. That is a top, top notch swing. Not many people are going to turn and burn perfect, perfect that. He's going to keep in Kershaw now with a little bit of a cushion. There's no need to take Kershaw out with a four run lead, but it's our job now to, to get Kershaw out of this game. He's going to break my bat on that. Is it going to get down? It is going to get down. So we got another chance. Left it in the middle and we absolutely crushed it. We've been on fire with Salvi. I don't even know if I'm going to be able to get a double on that. Not worth it to risk it. We got to kind of hope for a home run. Just leave him at first base. We can't be giving away outs. We need every single out. 
And that's a great pitch. Another slider that got in on my hands. And that's a big double play. That is a big double play. Jimmy Fox all over that one. Not going to get out. I think with where we had the PCI, we needed to be a little bit earlier on that one. Uh, what I'm noticing so far in this game is he really does not make mistakes compared to like I'm making many mistakes that would beat a lot of players. But this player, it's very, it's going to be very, very difficult. I mean, plays like that where he pops it up with Hornsby are few and far between. Uh, he's not going to make too many mistakes like that. Whereas like we're missing some pitches that we should be able to hit uh, in at bats. See, like, just like that, left the cutter in the zone. Eventually, I'm going to miss. And when I miss, he does not miss. Very good swing there. Bellinger's got his second home run. I really think he's one of the best cards in the game right now. And Mickey Mantle is going to hit another home run. He, you can tell he's sitting sinker. I'm using it too much on the first pitch. Corbin Burns just getting knocked around. We're going to have to go to somebody else. We're going to go to Billy Wagner. We've got to hang around. We've got to get out of this, and then we've got to at least uh, scratch across a couple runs to keep this thing going. Um, right now, he's definitely he's definitely in the mode. I, I know he's in the mode right now to try to get this run rule. And that is a good swing on that pitch because that was dotted low and inside with the fastball. He pulls it to the gap, doesn't quite get the home run. Not a bad swing left on left. I think we're gonna have to attack him with like more off speed also because he's been sitting on the sinker obviously was sitting on the fastball there now uh, we threw him a change up on the second pitch that's gonna be a long foul ball hopefully we can get him to chase not gonna chase there Moving with the hiding in 102 blew it by him all right we got to get like three here i just want to keep this game going i want to win but i, I don't want to get run ruled they want us to utilize our bench, so we're going to go to Mondesi. Luckily, our bullpen is pretty fresh. Too many pitches like that that we're missing. That's that's really, you can tell the difference between our two games. Like, he he's not missing those kind of pitches. Those pitches are hit over the wall, so that's what I got to improve on and take my game to the next level. Like, that's we're late on that. We've got to be early on it. Part of it's because he's a really good pitcher, but it's just like... We've got to be more uh, on point on that. And then we can really take a jump with our skill. There we go. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Pitched on the middle. Hit it to the gap with Willie Mays. I feel like he's, you know, he's not really pitching around us very much. And I feel like if we get down on the count to him, it's not going to be good. So we got to be in attack mode. I had a good swing on that one, but just not quite good enough. Tried to pull a low and outside slider for a home run. Couldn't, couldn't uh, pull it off on the ground just a dotted slider he's gotten me out on that pitch quite a bit going to rob dibble huge inning here we've got to keep him off the board he's gonna hit that one a long ways but it's gonna be fouled i tried to throw that inside slider that he's been throwing me and uh yeah i left it right out over the middle inside oh, well it's a cutter it's gonna be off fox's glove i'm so happy that he knocked it down he didn't make the play but he gave a good effort Oh, what a swing what a swing i mean that pitch was dotted on the inside after tunneling a cutter and he pulls it out for a home run left that one in the middle i'm like trying to get too cute trying to figure out any way to get it by him and you see what i mean like you, you miss in the middle and he hits a home run that's where we've got to get our game to where any kind of mistake pitch we just absolutely level so rob dibble just getting lit up. I mean, just getting lit up. Probably been a little silly with our pitch selection. And that's been a big factor. So we're going to try to live more on the edge. You know, I'm trying to throw like too many inside cutters. And I'm not really playing my game that I like to play. He's going to take out Kershaw and go to Springer. One home run will end it for him. And he doesn't even have anybody out in this inning. Going to walk short Springer. Oh, I don't know how we got that one past him, but we did. On the ground, that's going to be an out. Throw it down to second. He's going to be out at second as well. So we stayed alive. That's actually big. That's actually big. 
because if we can heat up on offense you never know what could happen so we definitely want to get something going here he's going to go to eric gagne mantle i think that's getting out so we bought ourselves another run i'm uploading this video no matter what too i want you guys to see the true road to the road to the world series experience you know gotta play against some good people Corey Seager absolutely smashed that one, but it's going to be fouled by a little bit. That, that ball was crushed. What a pitch. I mean, I was frozen. I thought that was like a fastball that was going to be up. Just an, a high changeup gets me. Oh, and then I, I blinked when I was swinging on that one. I should have let that one go. That That's the stuff that I just, you can't get away versus uh, these type of players. Like you can't, you can't throw away a bad stuff like that. Ooh, good swing good swing perfect perfect right back up the middle get a base runner jimmy fox is gonna go yard gotta keep fighting we've got to keep fighting six to our 12 to six if we can just get a couple more runs in this inning at least we got ourselves a little bit of breathing room he's gonna go to billy wagner we got to be careful with how many pinch hitters that we burn here we got soto frank thomas fernando tatis jr left um, I'm trying to think if I want to go to Frank Thomas. We'll have two left. It's a sixth. I mean, if we do bring it back to somewhat tied, we might need a pinch hitter later. I think we just got to try to hit left on left with Babe and just make something happen here. We uh, please stay fair. Please stay fair. Oh, that would have been huge. Oh, I was looking heat all the way and that inside slider got me. That's like one of his go to pitches. I don't see a lot of people throwing that pitch. But, uh, man, I was sitting so hard on the fastball right there. Uh, we got to go to Josh Hader. That's going to be our last lefty. Man, this is tough. This is going to be really tough. We have to go to – it's the same kind of situation. We have to go to Kenley Jansen here because I can't use my last lefty right now. And this is going to be tough. Like, all three of these guys just smashed le or righties. On the ground, we needed that play. Oh, we needed that play. Is he going to try – no, he's just going to stay at one. Oh, we needed a double play so bad. So it was kind of slow. Oh, why a step. I mean, all those pitches are right around the strike zone. He walks. I think we wouldn't have tried to pitch so cute in the first couple innings. We might have been closer, like trying to throw some. I tried to throw some crazy pitches to kind of get him off his game. But I should have just like stuck to the way I pitch, like not pitch with any fear. Got him on that sinker though. Is he gonna go home on this? He got he beats out the double play again. Oh, we might have got him on a waste pitch. Oof. Three and two here. Had to throw him something to hit. This is gonna be a huge catch if we can make it with Mike Trout. It didn't let me go into the ball. That's that's really tough right there. Unfortunately, it got locked in into an animation where he's ready to catch it off the wall like a bounce so i couldn't go into the baseball there that's on that's just unfortunate it happens we got to get this next out though going to rich gossage because kenley's already pretty much out of energy get a walk jimmy fox just really couldn't give him a, just couldn't really hit the zone that well that time he's gonna bring in a pinch hitter for billy wagner he's gonna bring in yellow she was very scary Oh man, please, please just get it out somehow, some way. Oh, we did it. We threw a slurve and we did get the out. We're going to continue the game. That's what really matters. A tough break right there with that one play. Tough break because we didn't get a couple of those double plays either, but we just got to keep fighting. We got to hit. He's put up 14 through six. We've only put up six. He's bringing in Dibble. Ooh, I thought that was going to be below the zone. Catches the zone to strike out Maze. Went with the fastball again. It's really tough versus Dibble because those pitches have such different speed differentials. Like, you got to sit on one of them. If you guess wrong, probably going to get out. That was a great swing. I mean, just kind of noticed that he was getting in a bit of a fastball pattern switched up our swing we read fastball perfect perfect home run from mike trout on 102 three and two we draw the walk that was a really tough at bat too 
Gotta come through here with Seeger. Was sitting on the heat. I just missed it with the PCI. It's tough. It's just tough to not be able to make like really any mistakes, but I, I like this a lot. I feel like I'm getting better. I'm learning. Hard part is just stopping him on offense. I mean, we put up seven, but he's put up 14. Put a change up. I mean, our sequencing of pitching pitches was perfect, but change up. I should have thrown my, like, it's almost like you got to aim that change up way outside of the zone. Cause you don't want it to catch any part of it. It's a home run with Hornsby. You can just see that bend of the change up and you just know it's a change up and if it catches the zone. It's going to hit, get hit hard. Sometimes you want it to catch the zone and stuff like that. You really don't care where it goes. You just want to switch speeds, but man, that's a tough one right there. It's just a beautiful swing. We got Mantle to strike out. And we're going to get Soto to get out. So we really got to go on offense here. Maybe get it back to 15 to 10, something like that. Uh, every, every inning's been so difficult to pitch, but it's just like, I, I don't even th feel like we're playing that bad, but we got to take our game to the next level. He's going to go to Brad Hand. That slider on the inside to righties on the edge for a strike has just punished me all game. And that's a pitch that we've got to hit it out for a home run. We've got to hit that out for our home run. Can't be popping that up. And that's another pitch. Like we got to hit that one out too. Got on top of it. Uh, just a small amount of room for air. Going to get Chipper Jones to pop out. I'm really glad that he swung on the first pitch too. Cause Gossage doesn't have much left. We've got Rivera left in the bullpen, but we're, you know, we're going through like all our arms just trying to get out. That is a great hit. I mean, such a great pitch sequence too. And he just takes it out for a home run. And that was, I want to see where that pitch ended up. I mean, that's just unbelievable hitting. Just the way I structured my pitches for him to be able to hit that out. He's going to finesse that one over the right field for a base hit. Luckily we do have Josh Hader as well. We're bringing out most. So we do have one more pitcher, but it's kind of now or never. We've got to get through this. He only needs one more run to win. He's going to pull that cutter with Jimmy Fox. We're going to be able to make the catch on that. So we got two down here. Pitcher's coming up next. I'm interested to see if he's going to take his pitcher out, if he's going to take Brad Hand out or just leave him in at this point. Looks like he's going to make a move. He's going to go to Tome because if he gets a, you know, he just needs one run to win. And he's going to pop that one up. So we've made it all the way to the ninth inning. And I'm pretty happy about that. I mean, if you really want to get better, don't friendly quit players like this. Get in, play, try to survive, see what they're doing. You know, it's always good to pick. Like, I've, I've seen him throwing that inside cutter and stuff like that, that inside slider a little bit more. I might in implement that in my game moving forward. But if I had friendly quit, I never played it. I'm not getting this experience. This is how you get better. You play against really good people online. And then when you play against people that aren't as good, you've already, like... I don't know. You you just built up that experience against good competition. So I'm we're losing big, but I'm happy with our performance. I know we can get better. A fastball right there. I mean, we're gonna hit that far with Soto. It's probably not gonna get out. It's off the wall. I'm gonna try for three because he hasn't picked that up yet. This is gonna be real close though. Pick up a triple. Oh, he blows a fastball by me. We got to be on that. Oh, why did I do that? Got myself out there. He's going to take the out at first. Doesn't care about the run. Obviously, he's being top nine. Ah, oh, I thought we were about to hit that for a home run, but we got on top of it. We're going to be out. Hey, we, I bring you all the games. I'm going to bring you all the games. Win or lose. I'm going to bring you all the games. Hopefully you got something out of this, you know, watching me play against a top 50 player. It's pretty funny that we made that guy with the uh, creative player quit as well. Be sure to drop a thumbs up on this video if you liked it. I would really appreciate that. Subscribe. We're on the road.
to 100k subscribers we're almost at 30k i want to get to 100k if you could support my grind i would really really appreciate that thank you so much for watching i'll see you in the next video make sure you check out the previous video if you missed it check out the merch store that would really really help me out and have a great one i'll see you soon peace out actually you know what i'll see you i will see you 3 p.m eastern every single day every single day we'll have a gameplay 3 p.m 3 p.m eastern all right peace out